Hi, I'm Joey. And I'm Sean. And today, we're taking a second glance at our mid-size up-and-coming city. <laughs> we may not be a big city. But we're bracing our questionable infrastructure to grow like one. Okay. Can you not word it like that? We're, re we're ready to grow and we're ready to be profitable. And we're ready to check out the sights and the bites. And cut. I just, you know... There's a lot of opportunity here. In order to pay respect to our city's identity, we've kept the rustic, historic water towers. They're kind of like a bat signal for where gentrification is going to happen next. No, don't. You can't say that word. I'm just saying, if I see a water tower, the wealth impaired are going to get kicked out. It's a positive change. For people who like artisan coffee. The economy. You're saying a lot of hot words. We have a progressive communal commons, which encompasses a brewery, artisan coffee, and tacos. It's essentially just a mall food court without the kiosk. No, stop it? saying food court. It's not the 90s. I, it's like about. a mall food court. I know, but when you lie with taste, that's called marketing. Dumb it up. Dumb it up. So that's actually a brewery in its infantile stage. No, actually, that right there, we don't have anything planned yet. We're just kind of digging around and looking for inspiration. It's called meditative bulldozing. That's going to be a brewery. You can tell we're in up-and-coming cities. We have a series of new and innovative bike trails. More of like an innovative way of losing money. They clutter the roads anyway. What do you think, you're a car? There's a G-Wagon. Oh, up and coming city bike. There's a G-Wagon. Lots of money here. Under this bridge is a kid's park by day, but at night it becomes a homeless shelter. No, no, don't say that. We've worked on relocating them. We've bought and everyone bus tickets to Los Angeles. You need to relocate them quicker. Your own compassion. I'm trying to grow our city. Grow your heart. There's an unsettling amount of open apartments here, but you're still going to pay for over asking price on our homes. Oh, no, no, there's a healthy opportunity for your family to practice paying a mortgage. It's New York living uh, without being in New York. Lots of opportunities here. We hired a local artist to paint a portrait of Shia LaBeouf. It's an up-and-coming city vibe right there. Brings back a lot of memories. You know, my dad wasn't around a lot. You can tell we're an up-and-coming city because we have the Delta variant. No, whoa, no, we do not. Uh, uh, Southwest Airlines is a variant to Delta. You're talking about Southwest Airlines? There's a, what are you doing? Cut it, cut We need to practice lots, lots of, of opportunity. opportunity. We have a super hip nightlife that ensures you'll always run into someone you went to high school with. He's not wrong. Why can't the person I always run into be Michelle? A uh, restraining order. Technicalities. That's the uh, speakeasy trolley. Yeah, you can suck vodka out of uh, hanging two. You can actually grab a bite while taking in the sights of loud lifted trucks and revving motorcycles. Has anybody ever told them that's not cool? It's actually kind of annoying. We should make a sign. Oh, is this their sign? Yes. You can tell you're from an up and coming city because middle aged men mistake wealth for having a personality. Come on, you're just mad that Jane left you for the mayor. Which is pretty cool. I mean, he's the mayor. He drives a white Corvette. His license plate says no mercy. Look, there's the mayor right now. She looks unhappy. She's laughing. Are you the mayor? No. <laughs> Pull up to the scene with my this is actually the founder of our city. My favorite brewery is named after him. My favorite hotel is named after him. Okay, grab here. At the brewery hotel? Yeah. Thank you. So this is pretty neat. We actually have a bridge where families and teens come to pretend to be happy for social media selfies. What's your problem? What? I'm just being honest. We actually pitched Tesla on moving their production here. What'd they say? Oh, they didn't open my email yet. I'll, I'll tag them on Twitter and LinkedIn. Oh, that's a great idea. Why do you follow Kelly Osborne? What? So that's actually a bunch of coffee being shipped into the city, which will then be charged at 500%. No, probably 600. 600%. I'm actually on a cleanse right now. You quit alcohol? No, I quit drinking coffee. I can't afford it here anymore. We actually have Tesla parking. No one really uses it, but we do have uh, is that a Tesla? No, that's a Toyota Yaris. Our mid-size venue attracts lots of big acts, like Michael Bublé. Oh, no way. That would have been awesome if it was 2011. Well, Louis C.K. is going to be here next week. What? The guy who... He apologized. Is it going to make money? It's going to make lots of money. You can tell we're an up-and-coming city because we love to celebrate pride. From exactly June 1st to July 1st at midnight. Then the rainbow crosswalks could cover up. They're tax write-offs. Oh, we shouldn't say that. We care. So we're actually building a series of parks here for the children. Oh, these will make great homeless shelters at night no, for the stop. homeless No, stop. can't say that. Don't say that. Don't say homeless. But you deforested. No, no stop saying def You can't say deforested. But we're, we removed a lot of trees. We're building a healthy amount of opportunities here. For families. For who? The homeless people or the dead animals? Stop. No, stop it. Deforestation and homelessness. Do you want to be reelected? You know, uh, Elon Musk and Jeff Bezos are obsessed with space, so they should come here because we have a lot of it. It looks bad how empty it is, but I ensure you it's safe. We, we have, have a lot of space that we'd love for entrepreneurs to explore. Residentials, commercials, mills. We'll give you an out-of-this-world deal. Anything that you want, we'll give it to you.